hello guys uh, so uh, welcome again uh, this is another SGI road practice test this time around we want to take the second route on downtown okay so I'm with uh, my friend and uh, he's going to serve as your examiner today so we'll just listen to him as we start this journey remember what I always tell you before you drive out of the SGI parking lot remember to signal and put your hand behind the passenger seat then look back three things one signal put your hand behind the passenger seat and look back while you pull out of the sgi parking lot okay so we're going to start now by pulling out of the sgi parking lot let's go guys Turn left at the end of this road. Okay. So you signal, mirror check, and shoulder check. Turn left at the end of this road. All right. You signal, mirror check, and shoulder check before every turn. And since you are entering a major road, you watch out for oncoming traffic. Road is clear, so we are just going to go. Turn right at first light. Okay. We are facing a green light, so we can just keep driving without stopping. Right turn on second light. Okay. about uh, 30 meters away so we signal now mirror check and we show the check and when you stop behind the vehicle make sure you are seeing the tires of the vehicle in front of you if you stop too close you'll be penalized okay so safe stopping means stopping at a distance where you can see the entire back tires of the vehicle in front of you just the way i have stopped in front of this vehicle in my front now okay now we have a green light as you move closer before you make the turn do another mirror check and another shoulder check to make sure the road is clear look out for pedestrians left turn at first intersection okay here is a two lane change you change the first time you mirror check and shoulder check you change again mirror check and shoulder check Okay, green light, but the vehicle in front of me is entering intersection. I'll wait. Road is clear before I'll enter myself. Left turn at first intersection. Okay. Signal. Mirror check. Shoulder check turn to the lane where you are going to change and keep your hands straight because you are facing a red light as you face this red light there are three things you need to wash out for you need to wash the light know when the light changes before you move wash out for pedestrians on the road you are going to drive into and wash out for oncoming vehicle on the straight line ahead of you because you are going to cross the main road so you want to be sure that you are crossing when it's safe okay so that's a green light vehicle coming 
I'll wait for the vehicle. It's a little bit far, but I'll still wait because we want to drive safe. Now the vehicle is gone. I'll make my turn. Second intersection, make a right turn. Sounds good. Okay, I'm gonna change lane here if I get to that second intersection because the road is free. I want to make it easy for myself. Facing a red light, so I come to a complete stop just before the crosswalk. Green light now, I continue straight. Okay, I'm gonna turn right, so signal, mirror check, to the check. Then I'll go close to the curb, as close as possible. And watch out for pedestrians, all clear. Make the turn, stay on the right hand lane, make sure you're not going to the left hand lane. Left turn at first intersection. Sounds good. Signal, mirror check is free, I change lane. I keep going straight. Right. I'll turn to the lane where I'm going to make the change. Here comes pedestrian. You have to stop for pedestrians. Don't go too close. Even if you have not reached the crosswalk, once you see a pedestrian, please stop. Don't go too close to a pedestrian. Some examiners might misinterpret that, that you are driving dangerously. So make sure you stay away from pedestrians. Pedestrians are very, <laughs> I mean, if you want to fail this test, then go too close a pedestrian, okay? So we're facing a red light. We'll wait for the light to change. Okay, light has changed. We move forward and enter the intersection because we're on green, but we can't see the road ahead of us. So we'll stop and wait, make sure we can see the road, make sure it's clear before we go. All right. All right, road is clear, so we go. Left turn at second intersection. Okay, sounds good. So we'll just go straight here. Red light, slow down. Stop. Okay, now it's green, so continue straight. Okay, so before we make the left turn, there is a free vehicle in our front. We are going to parallel park behind that vehicle. So if you want to parallel park, as you approach the vehicle, you signal, mirror check, and show that check, okay? So I'm parallel parking behind this vehicle. Stay about two to three feet away from the vehicle and line the, your back bumper just behind the vehicle. I wish you can see my back bumper. You cannot, but uh, it's okay. Then you put your vehicle on reverse. Put your hand behind your passenger seat. Then turn your steering. Complete your turn so that you approach the vehicle beside you at 45 degrees, okay? So we get there. 45 degrees, then we can start returning our hand now. Make sure you are seeing the curb behind you so that you don't climb the curb. Okay. Okay. So this is what you call a perfect parallel park because we are directly behind the vehicle in front of us. You can see the vehicle well positioned. We are not too far away. We are not too close from the vehicle. So that's a perfect parallel park, okay? And we did it just once, so you can do that too. Just uh, practice several times and uh, you can master the skill, okay? Now, after you parallel park, make sure you put your vehicle in on park because the examiner said you should park. So don't leave your vehicle on drive or on neutral. Once you parallel park, change your gear to the park position. That's important too, okay? All right. So after now, we're gonna move. So we're going to pull back a little bit before we go. We have to signal, remember, always signal when pulling back. Okay. 
free. Mirror check, Tudor check is free. There we can go. And here comes pedestrian. You stop fully. Allow the pedestrian to cross the road fully before you continue, okay? So pedestrian has crossed fully. We'll continue. So making a left turn. Yeah. We'll signal, mirror check, and shoulder check. Okay. Our pedestrian guy is still going to cross the road we are turning to, so we'll wait for him. We we'll stop fully until he crosses the road fully. It's all gone. Then we can now continue. Lots of snow, eh? I decided to do this in the snow because uh, I know a lot of you have issues driving in the snow. It's not such a big deal, okay? Just uh, make sure you are not uh, putting too much pressure on your accelerator. Left yeah. turn at first intersection. Okay, sounds good. That's a red light on the intersection with signal. I come to a complete stop just before the intersection. Okay, that's a green light. We go. Now you mirror check. You show that check is free before you go. Turn at 45 degrees to the road you are turning into. Here we go. Left turn at the next light. Sounds good. Signal. Mirror check. Show that check is all free. Light is green, no oncoming vehicle, so make the left turn. Stay on the left lane since we are turning from the left hand side. Right turn at next intersection. Okay, sounds good. You signal, mirror check, shoulder check, and go. Make sure you exaggerate your shoulder check. Turn your head very well so that the examiner can see you turning your head. Okay. It's a green light, so we we'll just keep going so long as there are no pedestrians. Left. There is a bicycle lane here, so please don't enter the bicycle lane ahead of you. You can see that. Right turn at first light. Okay, sounds good. Signal. Mirror check, shoulder check. It's a green light, but I see a pedestrian on the crosswalk, so I'll come to a complete stop. And allow the pedestrian to go please be very careful allow the pedestrian to leave the entire road before you continue okay so pedestrian is gone i'll make my turn now enter the drive lane left turn at first intersection sounds good signal mirror check to the check all free enter Okay, it's a green, so we signal again, mirror check and shoulder check. Here goes a pedestrian on the lane I'm turning to, so I'm just going to wait for the pedestrian. And there's an upcoming vehicle, I'll keep my steering straight. Vehicle gone, pedestrian gone, road clear. I'll make the turn. Right turn at first light. Okay, sounds good. So I'll signal, mirror check, shoulder check. I'll change lane. It's a green light, so I'll continue after washing out for pedestrians. There are none. Mirror check and shoulder check again is all free. So continue straight. Left turn at first intersection. Okay, so I'll signal mirror check, shoulder check in that order. Change lane is a two lane change, so I'll mirror check and shoulder check again. And make the turn it's very important when you make a two lane chain that you should have checked twice otherwise the examiner will take two points away from you very important so my road there's an upcoming vehicle although it's a green light so i will stop at the middle of the intersection and wait for the vehicles to pass they are all gone i will not take my turn even though it has changed to a, a yellow light amber i'll see make the turn 
right turn at next intersection. Sounds good. Signal, mirror check, judo check, it's free. I'll go. Stay behind the vehicle. Okay, that's changed to a green light. Make the right turn. And here we go. Right turn at next intersection. Okay, so this is a very long uh, straight road before we make that right turn. It's about uh, six or seven hundred meters, I think. And here they might watch out for your speed, so be careful here. Please do not go above 40 kilometers per hour here, okay? Just take it easy and on a working day, because today is a public holiday, the road is a little bit free. On a working day, you see a lot of pedestrians, a lot of traffic here, so be very careful on this road. Do not speed too much, okay? Just take it easy and keep going straight. So we're about uh, 30 meters away. Signal, we'll mirror check, shoulder check, all free, and turn right, close to the right curb. And go straight. Right turn on the next street. Okay, so we'll signal. Mirror check, to the check. There's a stop sign, so you come to a complete stop before the stop sign. Before you continue, you roll a little bit. Observe oncoming traffic. Road is clear. Make the turn and go straight. So at this point, we are back to the SGI office. You may be asked to either park on the road or enter the SGI parking lot. So let's assume we are entering the parking lot. So we're going to signal, mirror check, we should that check, all free, and we enter the SGI parking lot. And we're back here, where we started from. And my guy, that is how you pass the SGI road test. So just uh, get on the road, okay? Drive as much as you can, get familiarized with the route, and uh, before you know it, you pass the test easily and uh, you're good to go, all right? So don't forget, we'll have uh, other videos uh, on other routes, like Taylor Street routes. We also have uh, other videos on uh, things you need to wash out for, uh, mistakes that you need to wash out for to avoid so that uh, you don't make them and uh, you can pass the test, okay? Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.